tricky about these PVPs is a lot of times the first guy that goes for expansion will end up losing because, you know, unless that expansion gets up, it takes a little while for it to get up and to be mining. So you've got to have a lot of time to do that. So especially now that Observer's out, you have to be really careful about your expansion timing. And I don't think we're going to see either. Either we're going to see both players expand at the same time or neither player expanding. I actually think one player just expanded. It looks like Tester um, just expanded. So we'll see if Backo decides to just go in now with this Reaver while he's got it or if he decides to expand too. He's going to have to make this quick decision right now though. Yeah, uh, Backo, of course, doing a good job of uh, scouting out and being able to see the Reaver is there. Now, it's interesting because the disrupt disruption web could play a part. No, it's not going to. We see a huge battle going in. Both have one Reaver, it looks like. And it looks like they're so far so freaking even. Good hit there from some Scarabs. Looks like we have more Scarab hits coming off from Backo, But then some other Scarab hits coming from Tester. This is going to be almost exactly Well, no shuttle here. now. No, the shuttle went oh, down. I didn't see so the shuttle now that's going to be huge. But he oh! takes the Reaver down. Oh, both Reavers go down. Pretty much an even battle. He lost his shuttle. Now, that was sloppy. Backo should have pulled the shuttle back. He sold the shuttle. There was no reason to lose that. Right. He had the advantage for a moment there by not having the shuttle. But both the Reavers, for a while, were just content to shoot at each other's Dragoons. Uh, looks like Observer going to go down in the middle of the map. So, Backo a little bit on the back foot here. Um, yeah. He doesn't have expansion up, and Tester, his is going up. So, if he can just keep pressure on just long enough to have that expansion go into effect. See, now Backo is forced to put down a third gateway. Um, I imagine Tester's probably putting down a third gateway too because it's about the timing. But look, this expansion is up, and Backo has to pump out units now and get this done now, or he's gonna, just going to fall far behind. Right, and Tester's about to scout that Backo doesn't have an expansion. Notice that's where the Observer is going, right there. Um, if if Backo had saved that shuttle, he could have possibly got another Reaver out and maybe done a harass on the expansion of Tester and maybe got a few probe kills, and that's what he really needs now. Honestly, Tester is very far in the lead at this point. He came out of that battle one Dragoon ahead, and uh, they both lost their shuttles. Not having that shuttle, I think, was the big mistake by Backo in this one. They both micro very similarly, but uh, right now we are going to see Tester just start pumping out. And it looks like Backo's just going to suck it up and take this loss. I'm surprised. I mean, both players are getting the Reaver out first because they need it for defense, but that Reaver can't go attack with those Dragoons without a shuttle, so it's pretty much useless. I guess he's just going to wait for the shuttle, but in the meantime, Tester's just making more and more money, and that economic lead is going to be huge. And you saw Tester throw down, I think, a fourth and fifth gateway, at least third and fourth. Um, it looks like the fourth now going up for backhoe, but I, I do think that there's just going to be a superior unit advantage on the ground for Tester. Um, it can still come down to micro because it is a mere matchup, and, and micro is so important, but he's certainly, backhoe is certainly behind right now. Right, and uh, Tester getting a pylon out there to confuse the Dragoons. We do see a shuttle going. Now, this could be the drop that he needs, the one I mentioned before. If he can pull this off, and if he can get lucky and get a lucky sky. Oh, oh, no! He's spotted. He's spotted. Wow. Great job by Tester using that probe. I don't even... How did he... I don't even know how he knew that was coming there, but... He, he could probably just see it. It was barely in his range there. But, you right. know, also one thing to note is that there's no... Um, shuttle speed right now. A little surprising that, that, that neither player had upgraded at all. Well, I haven't seen actually Tester Shuttle, I don't think, really moving around. But it's really hard to do a harass like that when you got sh slow shuttle speed. That can be so risky, and I don't actually really like that decision by Backo. But, you know, he's feeling like he's got to do something. He still hasn't even thrown down his expansion. I just, this is looking really bad. I mean, he, we got two Reavers versus one, maybe two Reavers now. Uh, but you can, you can already see the Dragoon advantage for Tester already on the ground. Oh, look at this. Disruption Web could play a huge role here. Tester being smart. <laughs> that is, I've just, it's crazy to see that being used strategically. Look at that. Back goes two Dragoons that weren't firing there. And that could mean the game. We do see one re run Reaver going down. Backo doing a good job. Going to lose that shuttle right now. Backo has two Reavers. And yeah, it looks like wow, uh, Backo, Backo did a coming great out job on top. With Reavers. Where did those Look Dragoons at that surround. I don't even know. But uh, Backo just. I, I don't even know what to say. I didn't even notice that. The Observer didn't even see that. Well, what Look happened there is Backo's shuttle Reaver, Michael, which is better than Tester's. Tester lost his Reaver, and then Backo did lose his shuttle, but he still had two Reavers on the ground, pumping away, and like you said, he'd moved some of those Dragoons up to flank, and now he's all up in Tester's base. This is unbelievable, this comeback. If, if te if, wow, there goes two Dragoons, though, from that Reaver shot. Nice Reaver shot, being able to back up. Probes getting in the line, definitely stopping those Dragoons oh! from being able to get in. Oh, but tons of Probes go down. He's going to have a field day with these Probes. This, this, I mean, I, here's the thing. This could either be it or this could re-even the game back up because Backo still has not laid down his expansion yet. So 
is if if Tester is able to defend it, he loses the reaver. Oh, and a shield, the shield battery, battery going is up. down. Both of these these players are playing phenomenally right now. They're doing exactly what they should do in the situation. Backo has the upper hand though. He's bringing the dragoons in. He's going to try to push in, possibly into the main. There is another reaver out for Tester. Tester looking just solid right now. Taking out the shield battery, got a good reaver shot out there. I, this could swing either way here. Um, Critically, though, that nexus has not gone down. If he doesn't take out that nexus, although he's taking out some probes, he's still going to be behind because he's still mining, and, and even right now he's still mining from that nexus. So, again, amazing, basically, c c com comeback play from backhoe to be able to win that battle and get a superior edge, but I still don't know if it's enough because, like you said, he's not getting his nexus down. It doesn't look like he's going to do that anytime soon, so he's still... Still really all in with, with his play here, and, you know, back, Tester has a shorter distance again between his secondary, so his units are going to be able to reinforce faster, and he has a good defensive position. They're always got to do is get a nice arc on his Dragoons, place his Reaver well, make sure his shots, you know, are good, and I think it's going to be really tough for Backhoe to break this. I think if, if Backhoe can go in right now, get a little more harassed, because he didn't get very many drones when he got in there. He got maybe four or five, and then the rest kind of slid down. And now I don't think he got any back. drones. Huh? But he did get some. Oh, probes. he did get some pros. <laughs> hey, shut up! I'm a Zerg player. Uh, but no, you know you're right. I mean, I mean, Bako has a ton more as far as as uh, army goes. He has a lot more dragoons. He does have that. I don't know if he's gonna try to take some pot shots here. Ooh, this can be Ooh. risky. And there's still no shuttle speed. If you notice that. Right. But look at those dragoons from from Bako. He's got a lot of dragoons. Oh, good shot in that shot. reaver, and he's just leaving that reaver oh! out. He needs to pick it up. Terrible control by Tester not picking up his Reaver, and that could be huge. This could be the game if that. Oh, we just saw like four probes die there. Great Reaver shots. I I think this could be the game right here if Backhoe is able to finish this. Oh, oh wow. wow, that is it. All the goon blood on the ground. Dude. You can see it. That's just huge with that Reaver advantage. Reaver finally goes down, but it's too late. The shuttle's gonna go down. Those the goons are gonna go down. All he's got to do is snipe this last reaver, and that is it. Yeah. Um, he's moving Shuttle's in here. Down. Now, the one advantage, he, he, well, he does have that ramp blocking, but it's a downward ramp, so this is going to work in Bako's favor. Bako has the plus three that's miss it. chance, and that's going to be good. He's going to take out this reaver, and now he's in the main base of Tester. There's nothing Tester can do. We're going to see possibly ZZO, but probably just a GG. <laughs> probably just a GG, because we don't want anybody getting disqualified. We don't need a random A in here. There G -G! it is, GG. All I got to say is that back ho is back ho back ho is back you know amazing turnaround from being in a deficit that shows how strong back ho's pvp is he never made a second base he never made he a second base a it was all, base it was all us. micro and i don't know that does not bode well for tester in this series Dang. i gotta say back ho up one zero we're gonna go to the match on what's the next level outsider is right outsider we're gonna actually see a match and not a forfeit hopefully we'll be back <laughs>